George Tracy. It's absolutely fantastic to see you back in action and back on the track. Oh yeah, it's good fun. I haven't been out for a couple of months now, but uh, today I'm out in a new car. It's uh, an RS200 and I'm really looking forward to uh, getting it out there. I mean, some might say that back in the day when it first came out, the RS200 was almost revolutionary. Oh, it was indeed. It was a top car at the time, you know. Still is a top car, of course, for Rallycross. And how do you feel? I mean, are you kind of working the car well? I was, I was just out there my first heat now. I had a stall off the line. Uh, just totally getting used to the car. It's taken a lot of time. The clutch is very heavy. Uh, it's all, all point and squirt. And you've, you've no control. It's just pure power. Well, let's see how George deals with the pure power of the new RS200 as he comes to grey then for the second of our heats. Lawrence Gibson and Terry Briggs are on row two. That's Terry Briggs and there's uh, the man from Bambridge County down, Lawrence Gibson in the Metro 6R4. And the revs are up and they're away and George Tracy gets the RS200 well off the line but Lawrence Gibson gets alongside him and indeed gets ahead of him into the first corner but making a good move. Well, a brave move around the outside there is Terry Briggs. Well, this will be extraordinary if he makes that one stick. He's been forced to tow in behind Lawrence Gibson and indeed George Tracy holding that tighter line gets himself back into second place. Lawrence Gibson now in the 6R4 defending from the RS200 spitting flames there as we watch on board of George Tracy coming back up the hill to the right-hander then. Lawrence Gibson just power sliding the 6R4 through. Terry Briggs coming through in third as they turn onto the meadow. This is a very, very brave part of a Linton Hill as they come down fully lit and turn onto the rough. Down at the bottom, the uh, car bottoms out. Lawrence Gibson defending that line very well as he turns back onto the rough. And for a novice in this RS200, George Tracy doing a fantastic job there to keep in touch with the 6R4. Oh, the Lance Gibson runs out wide, and that's a huge shot for Lance Gibson. Goes out wide there, crashes into the tires, and full marks to Terry Briggs. Seeing Lance Gibson spin in front of him, he just jammed on the brakes. Here we get another view from a different angle, and that was a huge shunt. But these cars very powerfully put together with a huge roll cage. So let's hope that Lawrence Gibson himself is okay after that one. 